welcome to the latest update program the topic of discussion is rising arctic wildfires recently high intensity wildfires have erupted in the arctic region over 160 wildfires have burned nearly 460000 hectares in sakha russia wildfires have been a natural part of the arctic's boreal forest and tundra ecosystems however in recent years their frequency and scale in the regions have increased primarily due to global warming the arctic has been warming four times faster than the global average since 1980 Arctic temperatures have risen by approximately 3 degrees Celsius while global temperatures have increased by at least 1.1 degrees Celsius above pre-industrial levels. This fast-paced warming has led to more frequent lightning in the Arctic which has further increased the likelihood of wildfires. The polar jet stream which circulates air between mid and northern latitudes has slowed due to reduced temperature differences between the Arctic and lower latitudes. This has led to prolonged periods of warm weather and heat waves. which can cause more wildfires according to a report by the worldwide fund it is estimated that wildfires in the arctic and around the world could increase by 1/3 by 2050 arctic permafrost contains approximately 1700 billion metric tons of carbon that's roughly 51 times the amount of carbon the world released as fossil fuel emissions in 2019 wildfires destroy insulating layers of vegetation and soil making permafrost more vulnerable to thawing Thawing of permafrost releases ancient organic carbon including methane and carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. A large scale thawing of permafrost could trigger a massive release of carbon making it impossible to limit global warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius. Now is the time to test your knowledge. The question is the Sakha region recently in news due to intense wildfires is located in which country? Canada, Russia, Norway or Denmark? Send us with this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications